Quand de me prend dans ses bras, il ne parle tout pas. Je vois la vie en rose. Il me de mon amour, de mon de tous mes choux. Il est comme un platypus. Hey, let's move. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. It's 7.13 in the morning. Don't ask why we're up. I'm an early riser, what can I say? I have one of my best friends in town, Caroline. My literal other twin. I get a lot of questions on what I do on the weekends. This is gonna be a literal prime example because this just goes to show that you can still have wholesome, fun weekends without getting sloshed. I'm gonna make a coffee and then we're gonna have a really fun day planned. So stick along, happy to be Sunrise is coming in right now. Is it good? All right, we've got a whole itinerary. Literally me, all the time. Look at your new face, look at your new Guys, look how big he's getting. Like, who let you be this big? We're doing a bunch of different things. Currently, it's like 7 a.m. At 9 a.m., we're gonna go to Guru Donuts downtown. Fun fact, I've lived here for over six months and I've only been there once, but it is amazing. And I can't believe I haven't gone more. I think it's just because Going downtown, you know, parking and stuff, but free parking because it's Sunday, so we're good with that. But if you guys know what Voodoo Donuts is, it's kind of like that idea, the wild out there donuts. So we're gonna go there at 9 a.m. and then at 10 a.m. we're gonna walk downtown. I'm planning on bringing matcha this whole time. That way he can get like his exercise in and I always just feel bad leaving him. So we're gonna walk downtown. Maybe we'll even walk the campus because everyone's probably gonna be really drunk and no one's gonna be out <laughs> from last night. So, <laughs> so we'll be good. <laughs> so we'll be good and then at 12, around 12 to 1, we'll probably come back here, eat lunch. Then we're gonna film a little get ready with us for dinner. Did you just turn on the TV? Turn on, my dog is psycho. You need to stop. <laughs> we're gonna do a get ready with us for dinner at 4, and then at 7.15, we're gonna go to dinner at this place in Eagle called Cones. We have dinner reservations. So after that, we might go out and get dessert. I really want to take Caroline to Blue Cow frozen yogurt. It's like this adorable frozen yogurt place. Or I'm going to text my friend and see if there's anything going on in the Boise area. Cheers to a fun <laughs> event filled day. My dog is on crack. He literally is insane. Insane. We're going to do a little OOTD for you guys. Caroline? Start um, us off. Okay, so my pants are the flare leggings from Harry. And then this vest is from Amazon, this is from Grey Bandit, and this hat is from Aloe, but I feel like I look like a New York taxi driver, so I might take it off. <laughs> Outfit today, we've got this little sweatshirt on from Story. Then leggings, I've got on my flare from Lululemon. Look at how cute these socks are. I feel like these socks scream me. <laughs> <laughs> They're from Princess Polly. <gasps> from Princess Polly. And then my hat is from Brandy Melville. Hoops. Amazon, believe it or not. I cannot wait to get Guru Donuts. This is what I need right now. I haven't had a donut in so long and I'm so hyped. Yeah, same. So we're gonna leave right now. Pray for us, we're taking cha-cha. <laughs> you better be good. He was eating a Princess Polly tag this morning. I don't even know how he's here right now. Okay, we'll see you guys later, bye. We made it downtown. It is beautiful outside right now. I was kind of expecting it to be more cloudy. No, it's actually really sunny. Yeah, it's, it's like really sunny. Perfect. Guru is literally right ahead. Very excited to go there. Yes. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I don't know why. Mom's just being really scared right now. You wanna say hi? <gasps> say hi! We took pictures in the car with Matcha. Yep. He's the real star of the show, let's be honest. <laughs> it's a good day. We can literally see our breath outside right now. <laughs> Holy cow. This is so good. <laughs> this is so good. What did you get? I got the, y'all can't see it. I got the old fashioned glaze and coffee cake. I got the strawberry champagne donut. Taste test. <laughs> That's actually scary. Oh my god, 
Take a bite out of this. Mm. Goes, there's a Dutch Bros. There is, um, there's one right there. Say less. Say less. Say less for real. That was literally the best one I've ever had in my life. It was so good. Amazing. 10 so out of 10. Good. Matcha is literally He's living. He is living. He's breakfast. just trailing along at this oh. point. Perfect match on Netflix. It's kind of one of those like stupid reality shows, but I really like them honestly. They're just like I think it was entertaining. They're just fun. So yeah, we did that. Um, I got some blue corn tortilla chips, sprinkled some cheese on there, added the leftover taco meat and so rice. Fire. And I had now, never had blue blue corn tortilla chips, and they're oh yeah, God, dude. I love blue corn tortilla they're so chips. Good. Now what are we doing, Carolyn? We are going to the movie theater, and we're gonna watch. What's it called? It's called now. <laughs> English. Knock? It's called Knock at the Cabin. Knock at the Cabin. Yeah. Not like scary. Cabin. So. Yeah, we watched the trailer and it looks good. Scary. We were deciding between that and then what was that Tom Brady one? That uh, really 80 good? for Brady. 80 for Brady. We wanted to see Magic Mike, but <laughs> yeah, that didn't work out either. Yeah, so. The timing of when Knock at the Cabin ends, it'll be perfect with getting ready for dinner, yeah. going, all that stuff. Getting everything done for the day. Caroline has never seen Regal Edwards Theater and it is literally straight out of Stranger Things. Like the theater is 80s themed. I've it never is... seen Stranger Things either. Oh my god, Caroline. <laughs> I literally I'm gonna culture been, her, don't worry. There have been so many things that I've been like, no, I don't know what that is. And she's been like, what? And I haven't been to the movies in so long. It's been a fat minute. I think the last movie that I saw was something like a Marvel one, I wanna say. The last one I saw was Minions, but it was like last summer and it was with my ex's family, so. <laughs> Yeah, so the inside is like very 80s themed. This is so cute. It's adorable. Also, just this whole area is really this cute. This whole town too. is like so precious. I'm romanticizing Boise for Caroline. No, seriously. <laughs> like, oh my god. Shit. <laughs> oh, you're lying. Are you kidding me? This is so cute. No, dude, this is real. Debrief in the car. We just got out of the movie theaters for reference. No, I literally was sitting there like low-key sweating. I was like, this is very intense. That was one of the most like my heart has never gone so fast yeah. for two Look hours at the straight. Look at the, light. the most unsettling thing I think I've ever watched in my life. <laughs> it wasn't scary in the sense of like jump scare. Jump scary. scare. It, it wasn't, wasn't like that. that. It mm. was just intense. It was very, very intense. I can see yeah. why it's rated rated R. But still, oh my gosh. I'm like that was really thought provoking. What if that actually what if so it happened? Yeah. And thank God when we got out of the theater it's like beautiful and sunny outside. If it was raining, I probably would have started crying. The sun right now is making everything yeah. better, but only watch it if you don't have high blood pressure, because <laughs> yeah, my heart is yeah. going really fast right now. Caroline and I just looked at each other so many times <laughs> in the movie, and we were just like, every time like something happened, we both would just go like this, because yeah, we, we like, couldn't watch. We're gonna paint, get this stress out. Guys, we have a bad problem. <laughs> we we went to Dutch Bros once, once yesterday, and now and now we're back. We're addicted. <laughs> we also, this it. whole vlog is literally just us. Just enjoy our life, cause mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I got the double rainbow. It's like Red Bull with strawberry and peach. It literally tastes like a peach ring. It's really good. It is very very good. I got the iced white chocolate lavender cold brew. 
and I added oat milk because oat milk is not a fee. If you didn't know that, Dutch Bros does not charge you if you wanna get alternative milks, which I think every coffee shop should do that, but mm -hmm. I understand some of them can't. Anyways, we're gonna head back home. Matcha is probably so pissed at me right now because we left him for like three hours while we saw that movie. It is 4.13, Caro and I are getting ready to go out. For dinner in three hours, but we're giving ourselves time to take pictures and do all the good do all the good stuff yeah so we're getting ready early we have no mirror except for this camera so so hopefully this camera does us justice justice yeah. we're just gonna walk through what we're doing and then we're also just gonna do a little chit chat right. i don't have any questions prepared but we can do some life updates and also i don't think that we've ever talked about how we've met i don't think we have either yeah maybe on a live we have currently i'm going in with the Beauty Counter Counter Match Adaptive Moisture Cream. Before I do any makeup, I always go in with moisturizer because I get very, very dry skin here in Idaho. I'm using the Versed um, Skin Soak Rich Moisture Cream as my moisturizer before. And my skin is so bad, I can't. Going in with some Aquaphor. Like I said, my skin gets really dry and Aquifer is my holy girl. Quick Wait, I'm, I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna <gasps> you wanna try it? it? Yeah. Okay. I haven't seen this anywhere actually. I just decided one day that I wanted to mix these two together, and I think that I have found the secret foundation combo yeah. mix to give you like glowy, illuminated skin. So basically, what I do is I put on the Rare Beauty illuminating drops, and I use the shade Flaunt, and then I go in with my Mac Studio Fix Fluid Foundation, which is also one of my favorite foundations that I've ever used, and it gives you the most beautiful luminous look ever so I just do like this oh my god it's so dark mix that foundation on top I can't see it on my forehead my forehead is going to be glowing quick little story time of how <laughs> Caroline and I met yeah we actually met through a friend who we're no longer friends with but Still love her. Still love her. Really glad that she introduced she introduced us, us to yeah. each other because it was we never really probably would have hung out. I feel yeah, like. Yeah. No, I don't think her. we would have. She is actually two years younger than me. Yeah. Like not. <laughs> Everybody thinks we're that the same age. We're the same but age, but Caroline is surprise. Literally a junior in high school, if you can believe that. Yeah. When we first met, you were in eighth grade. Were you in eighth grade? Oh my gosh. Yeah. Wait, was I? Yeah, you were in eighth grade. Now oh my a gosh, I was in high school. Oh wow. Yeah. Yeah, that's. Time insane. flies. Time does fly. That's crazy. And then we decided to go to the same school. We all went. We, we all, all ended up went. going to the same school. Mm -hmm. like the us friend and the friend and then another friend that we're also not friends with anymore. But we <laughs> all went to the same school for her junior year and my freshman year. Mm -hmm. And it was a Christian private school. She didn't last. A semester? <laughs> she did last a semester. She well, ended no. up. Okay, I did, like, I went, like, the whole semester, and, like, I was fine. But then after that, like, I kind of realized that, like, it was, one, not the place for me, and, two, like, we could be taking the classes online, and I was like, deuces, like, I'm out of here. So she literally so left me. I literally just stayed at home and did my work, and, yeah, I just did not have any want to be there anymore real quick now i'm going in with the tarte ultra creamy shape tape concealer the best thing that they ever could have come out with because i love their shape tape their regular one but my skin was always really dry so now that they've got the creamy i am in love she ended up leaving going to a public school the next year and then i finished out my senior year there but we remained friends yeah. even through you know thick and thin, thick and thin. oh my god Both. those concealers Literally amazing. I don't know. Like I never know like where to conceal. What the matter? What the matter? Alrighty. We all baked up. This is the Pillow Talk Dreams Charlotte Tilbury palette. There's two shimmers and then two mattes. I'm gonna go in with the top matte one. And I'm just gonna brush this. Matcha is climbing my back at the moment. He is? Oh. <laughs> hey. He's so funny. He's so funny. Only thing about makeup by Mario I don't like is that they don't have a mirror right here. I feel like doing the round nose like thing makes your nose look so much better. Real question, comment down below who you think is gonna win The Bachelor. Oh, yes. Yes, yeah. yes, yes, comment please. I am placing my bets on Katie. Same. Or that Jess girl, I feel like she's gonna make it really far. Yeah. She's adorable. Yeah, she is adorable. I have this theory that they do screen time as like a, ta like a tactic 
So the girls that they're now just introducing could potentially be the winners yeah. to throw people off, you know? Like, I feel like they're very, very strategic when it comes to things like that. No, yeah. They definitely are, because they've also been doing it for literally so long. They know. But, like, they know, like, what works for TV and stuff now. Mm-hmm. The last few season. seasons have been, like, actually insane. See, this is the first season that I've ever watched. This is the first season I've ever watched. Oh. Yeah. Lex. Hannah Brown season. Was that one good? Dude. I would rewatch that. Let's put this baby on. I've been sneezing so much. Like. But it's so not just much. one sneeze. One, two. Three. It literally yeah. is like four or five every time. And my mom sneezes like that too. So I definitely got that from her. But like it is so annoying. I think it's better to do that than just like a bunch every five minutes. Yeah, that's true. I'd rather get it all out. These sneeze is so quiet too. I'm like, yeah. I sneeze like a literal donkey <laughs> when I do it. Like it's bad. The whole room knows. It's time to do some owls. Whatever happened to our like curse of era? Like when did we just stop? Oh talking? my gosh. Caroline and I have had a lot of eras. We've had a Miranda Sings era for sure. <laughs> like when we first met, we were still talking like that. We also had a cursive era. We yeah. also had a baby talk era, which we still do. We still do that, yeah. And she's the only person that I can do it around without people being like, what is wrong with you? Like, what are you doing? I do it like all the time too. And no. it drives everyone crazy. And I'm like, sorry, it just like comes, I don't know. Oh, uh, hello. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at my dog. Can, can you not? Cha cha, what are you doing? Oh. <laughs> that wasn't a part, I swear. Another era that we had was our football game era. Oh. Whenever you were cheering and then like we would go to Torchies after the game. Stop. When I was a cheerleader, let's talk about that. Honestly, I feel like I, I learned a lot even though I am not gonna put my kids in private school probably. I learned a lot just from being there and but I am glad that I spent all my life basically in a public school. Oh yeah. You know, but I think you can learn valuable yeah. things from both. I got on this dress from Princess Polly. Carol? Um, I have this dress from Caroline's closet. It's a little braids in my hair. It's giving mermaid. Really? Leaving right now for dinner. I threw on my teddy jacket. Literally the most comfy and warm thing ever. Carol forgot her wallet, so she's running inside to go grab it. But, I am so excited to go out. I I love dressing up and I feel like I haven't dressed up in so long. It's just so sad because every girl needs to dress up at least once in their life. So anyways, we're gonna head out to dinner. I will see you at Cones. Yay! Are you ready to grub? Yes, I'm so excited. Okay, so basically this whole menu is amazing. The waitress was like, oh, you brought your camera. I was like, yes, I did. <laughs> Y'all, I'm not even exaggerating when I say that this is amazing. Please bury me with this pasta in my casket. We are going to Blue Cow Frozen Yogurt and Caroline is gonna meet all my friends from Boise. So excited. Well, not all of them, but yeah, there's gonna be there's gonna be quite a few people there. And we're bringing matcha because I always bring my little cha cha matcha everywhere. Um, I changed into this super comfy seaside sweatshirt and then these brandy sweatpants. I cannot wait to have frozen yogurt, you guys. But I'm not gonna bring my camera. I'm just gonna vlog on my phone. So see you guys there. He has ice cream on his nose. <laughs> Good. Okay. Mm. Mm -hmm. I got strawberry dolce de leche and chocolate Oreo. Mm. What do you got? I got vanilla with Oreos and matcha. And matcha. <laughs> None for matcha.